Right, another Barvember bar modelling question from White Rose Maths. Freya, Jess and Kim each have some money. Jess has half as much money as Freya and Jess gives two-fifths of her money to Freya. Kim gives Freya three quarters of her money and the very lucky Freya now has £168 and Kim has £24 and we're asked how much did Freya have at the start? Okay, right, um, we all might draw different models. Um, I, th I, You know, I'd probably start here and then maybe do one for here, but I'm actually going to draw a block just to think about what the whole problem looks like. All right, this is, this block represents how much Freya had in the end. So Freya in the end. Okay, and let's see, let's sort of divide it up. It's a part whole model. Um, I'm going to imagine that this is how much Freya had in the beginning. At the start, I've just decided would be a shorter thing to write. So Freya's money at the start. Now the size of this is completely arbitrary. I'm just drawing a block to represent that. It doesn't matter about the size. Um, I've also, we've also got at the end, um, Freya has had some money from Jess and has had some money from Kim. Okay, so that's what this block represents. All right, so the whole block represents how much Freya had in the end. Um, do we know anything else about this whole block? Well, yes, we know that the whole block um, is worth 168. So I'm going to put that in as well, that the whole block has a value of 168. Okay, do we know anything else? Well, no, we don't. Um, and for a part whole model, we know actually very little at this point. This is our ultimate question, how much money Freya had at the start. Um, usually in a part whole model, you might know what some of the other amounts are, but we don't know either of these yet. Okay, I say yet, hopefully we'll be able to populate that with some numbers. Okay, so clearly we've got to try and find out what these numbers are or something like that to try and establish what the value of this block is. Okay, let's see what we've got then. Jess has half as much money as Freya and Jess gives two-fifths of her money to Freya. Both of these are, get the bar model, are very excited um, here we can draw a model to show that Jess has half the amount of as Freya and we're also told something that we can divide Jess's amount of money into fifths. Okay, so that's um, perfect for bar modelling. So I'm going to draw something, I'm going to draw a block to represent the amount of money that Jess had in the beginning. Right, and I'll be dividing that into fifths. And then I can draw a block for Freya. And her block, as we've discovered, is twice Jess's. And I'm going to divide it into fifths, just as I've done Jess's. Okay, so I know that each of these blocks is of equal value to each of the other blocks. That's not always the case in in your models. This value, I'm not saying that Jess's value here is the same as Kim's, but I do know what this means to me, all right? But in this case, all of these blocks I know are of equal value. Right, what else do we know? We know that Jess gives two fifths of her money to Freya. Okay, so let's see how we're going to denote that. I'm going to shade in these two fifths and I'm going to show that they've gone over here and there we go, that two fifths added on to Freya's block. All right, okay, 
can we put any more numbers in or any more information no I don't think there's anything else we can do at this point okay let's let's continue right Kim gives Freya three quarters of her money okay that's another great block to draw so I'm going to draw a block for Kim and I'm going to divide this into quarters because we've been given four as the denominator here and we can partition Kim's money into quarters now I know that this is not I'm not thinking that this is the same value of, as that and I know that because this is my model that I'm drawing so and I know what it represents okay so Kim gives Freya three quarters of her money still wondering what Freya has done to deserve all this Okay, so this is the three quarters and this is to Freya. I'm not going to sort of add it on to this model um, because, you know, this won't mean anything up there because this these blocks are not the same. All right, so I'm going to leave this down here. Right, and do we know anything else? Well, yes, because we're told that after... Kim gives Freya three quarters of her money she has 24 pounds left which is fantastic because we now know that one quarter equals 24 so what we can do is um, calculate how much she gave to Freya so 24 times 3 because we've got the three blocks over there gives us 72 so this amount is 72 so what does it, what do we now know then well we now know what Kim gave I'll use a different color we now know that Kim gave 72 pounds to Freya and we have this amount here that means that we're going to be able to calculate what this is because if we subtract 72 from 168 we're going to get this value okay so 168 subtract 72 gives us 96 shall put it back in the red there so we know that this is 96 this amount here All right what does that tell us well where else do we have Freya represented well we we have Freya represented here and we now know that 96 is the amount of money that Freya has when you include Jess's contribution so that is all of this so we know that this is 96 and we also this is subdivided into very helpful equal size parts how many are there so that well there were 10 remember there were um, two holes of fifths so the 10 along here plus the 2 that's 12 so we now need to calculate if we do 96 divided by 12 we should be able to establish the value of each of these blocks so 98 divided by 12 actually I'm not going to go through it we know from our times tables that's the that's each one of these is 8 I'm just going to draw one in I'll write that above there okay so that's 8 right so now what can we do well what I want to know do I want to is this what I've been asked for no I've been asked how much did Freya have at the start which is this bit here all of the white part not including those two blocks that's what I want to know so how many blocks are these well there's 10 of those so that's 8 times 10 8 times 10 equals 80 so actually 
that's that's pretty easy isn't it so our answer is Freya had 80 pounds at the start now what other questions could we have answered well of course we also could have um, we, we also could put an amount in in here for Jess how much did Jess give well she gave all the, these blocks are worth eight so she gave 16 okay and Freya had at the start well that's the answer we've just discovered there 80 pounds okay I hope that helped <laughs>